And we're back in the game with some more Third Age Total War, Divide and Conquer. Playing as the Dwarves of Ered Luin. Now, was it not in the last episode where we wiped out Angmar? I think it was, or it could have been two episodes back. But finally we wiped them out. Now we just need to rush and grab some more territory for our victory conditions before somebody else beats us to it. So I think we are sending this army around here and we're going to have to go to war with somebody else. Uh, I guess the Orcs of Gundabad. Luckily it looks like our cousins from the uh, Iron Hills and Eriabor uh, are also over here. So they've got territory over here. Now there is a settlement up there and I think that must still be in the hands of the Snow Orcs. But we could grab Latash. We could try to. I mean, we can see what's in there. We've got the snow trolls. Here's a big population. Can we get you in here? No. Let's try having you spy on somebody. Best chance is spying on our cousins. Oh, we got killed. Oh, great. Well, let me just check my sound actually. Yep, should be fine. So, money should be coming in quite well. Let's get another agent. I'm sure we can get one over here partially. So we've got 12,000 left. Uh, let's upgrade any economic buildings we can. Is that going to add any money? No. Public health helps with population growth though. Thing is, I would like that and just for some reason it doesn't bring in that much money. 3219. 1205 minutes, adding 20 there. I mean 80 there. It's literally 100. It's going to take 48 turns to pay itself off. That doesn't make enough sense to me. Anything economic care? Mining network. Okay. We've got some mining. 200 going up to 4, so that's an increase of 2. Plus 75 there, so it's going to go up by 275. Again, that's going to take many, many turns to pay itself off. What else does it do? Population growth. I mean, that would help. They just don't make enough sense economically. Great Miners Hall. No, nope, nothing really useful there. I mean, this does help with population growth, I think. Yeah, there, 0.5 up to 1, and it only costs 100, uh, 1k, so you know what, that healer's post again, with the port, 832, so it's adding 60, 68, but then, okay, that's negligible, but 68 gold, it's not really worth it we'd get more money from having a big population. So let's put that in. So is that everything? Kind of. Right, let's go with that. Uh, we've got a Diplomat somewhere around here. He can't move just yet. So, Angmar, the bane of our existence for the last 140 odd turns, um, actually went out with kind of a whimper. They were a big threat for many, many of those turns. Even up to the last couple of episodes, they have thrown some rather large armies at us with high quality troops, but we killed off their faction leader, Agandar. 
overlord of Khandum. And that just wiped them out. So I think we actually need eight more settlements. It took 144 turns to get something like 12 settlements. Yep. And we started with two, didn't we? Yeah. Right, let's go and talk to our cousins. Malcolmfo, that's apparently demanding, but they gave it in any case. Probably because uh, Anar, the gossip, was a very good um, diplomat. Right, let's buy it partially. Three units of Gobadrine. Okay, pop over to Barshaleg. You're coming over there. We've got one over here, so Northern Doom and Dine are pushing up here as well. We shall not see you, sir. That's we still a goblin see. settlement, looks like. Stalking now, sir. I think we also have a diplomat all the way down here. I guess we're going to send him to Gondor, maybe. So we've still got troops to move. No one moving there. Nobody to move from there. We're getting a new general. I think we got him there, didn't we? Right. This one I'm just going to disband him. Right. Six thousand for that. Is it going to be a big boost? Eleven forty-seven. Yeah, I mean seven hundred. We can live with that. Marshall Lake, we got hub. So we're already at sixteen percent. Beast Hall. We don't have the uh, Stoneworkers Guild. All right. I think by the time we have that. Uh, we'll be able to recruit troops. Got the brewery here, so need a pub as well. That's a full stack. Let's get them coming around. So we know there's a good sized garrison over there. We need to pull some troops together. Right, get you moving. Ah, he's the one who has the uh, one ring, isn't he? I was going to send him off on a suicide mission. It's a shame, because he's my faction here. But I can go over there, or I can just send you against Latash. They will indeed. Can't do anything over there. Right, do we have another general? The Swarm we had some more generals. Maybe they just all got killed off in the battles we've been having. Hmm. Yep, we do need more generals then. They all have armor upgrades already. Well, we'll have to send them out without a general. Unless we send him over there. Last, are we that short on generals? What's our family tree looking like? 
These are all females. He's already come of age, hasn't he? Yep, you're widowed. Yeah, there's a lot of female dwarves out there. Ah, maybe that one back there hasn't come of age. No, he hasn't. Age 952. Yeah, you can see how many generals we've lost. Right, I think that Curie character might come of age very soon. Nope, he got in to Gundabad, and that's the ancestral home of uh, Durin's folk. So we should want to claim that back. Uh, the Snow Orcs have no right to it. Even though the, apparently there was not actually a Dwarven settlement there. That is where Durin the first uh, awoke after being created by Auli. But then he, he went off wandering around the world founding Moria. So Mount Gundabad was kind of like a meeting place, but not a permanent settlement as far as I know. Of course I could be completely wrong. And if I am completely wrong, somebody should point it out to me. Yes, the journey is over, right, let's go and talk to the Woody Elves again. Tis good to see you, my friend. How can we help? Back info. No, we just rejected. We well, we'll figure it out as we go along. Run likes us. Yes, my king. Yep, that's a big uh, goblin settlement with trolls. On my way. So the elves are not doing too much over here. Yeah, go and investigate. Stalking me, sir. Where Can you get any mercenaries? No. You shall slaughter my king. March. Right. I Keep on forming up. I. We could send them in there for the armor upgrades. My king. On march. I. March. Because it's not costing that much, and they are getting up to gold chevron. My king. And what's all go up over in there? No right, that one's been retrained. It'd be nice if we could get some generals over there as well, though. Right. Today, Any retraining? No further today. Halfling, is your culture not no? thirty two percent? So why are we not getting free upkeep? Are we missing a building? Miners quarters. I think we need that so we can get some free upkeep. Last. So we can get Dwarven labourers over here now. Uh, anyone to merge? Nope. My king. I side. My king. Well, that's I four, I five. That'll be sixteen units from there. Hmm. Uh, Culture increase? No, don't need that. Minus quarters. The law bonus will be useful over in the east. Those buildings. And we can put in a healer's hall to 
boost the population even more. Right, that will actually give us a little money. Now the problem there, that's that corruption. What's going to remove that? 15% for law. 10.22. Yeah, it's only going down by about 80. It's not really worth it. I'll put that in. don't think we're ever going to get that built up enough by the end of the campaign. That's going to be sad because apparently there's some unique units coming out there. Right. Need to build those armies. They'll be begging for their lives soon. March. I mean, we could, in fact, bypass Latash with that second army. Because that's just a rebel settlement, and then send both those armies over to Gundabad. Because they'll probably get a big garrison at Gundabad. Snow Orcs will. Uh, they'll certainly send a lot of forces to relieve from that siege. My Lord of Moria is dead. Interesting. High Isles Resplendent. That's not good for us. Take the Rebel Settlement. Okay, well, we do now have a mission for that. So. So what are the High Isles actually doing then? Do they have territory over here? Uh, looks like... No, that's a brown border, isn't it? On this side? We should be down into Gondor's territory, if Gondor still exists. Of course, sir. Yes, sir. Well, it is good to see you, my friend. How can we help? Very demanding. Really? Uh, give me some money, then. Because he's an excellent diplomat. Well, we got it. You hold us at ransom until we meet again. Of course, sir. Today's journey is over, Your Honor. Always happy to deal with you, trusted friend. I am not quite a. Good you leader. will give me map info. Yes, sir. I'll, I'll use you as a spy. Aye, sir. I'll continue tomorrow. You know what? Just come down there. Right. All of those are full strength. Well, you are. You only need a few more units. Right. Ang Sul and Kandun all at the front lines. We've got the healer's post over there. Yeah, it's a terrible population. Terribly small. You know what? We need 5,000. Let's try that. Go for drying. Uh, you're not doing anything critical back there. How soon before I can get some more generals? Probably quite a while. 
22 turns. Okay, not so good. Hmm. Unless we get a Man of the Hour event. Money starting to pile up now. Okay, he was spying, wasn't he? Looks like there's a large snow orc army at uh, Orston or Yorston. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Alright, what are we going to do? The High Elves of Linden and the Madras are victorious. Well, I'm going to click on continue playing and we're actually going to decide later. But we'll finish off this uh, episode. Yeah, I just took too t uh, long wiping out Angmar. Well, they were a tough nut to crack. Looks like our cousins are sending a lot of forces against Gundabad. We, I wonder, do we still have that mission to send uh, this general, who's about to get attacked, over to Rivendell? I'm going to order resolve them. He killed 410 just by himself. We'll make them regret that. Okay, baggage train lost. That Gundabad besieged. Let's declare war. No, uh, he didn't quite make it. Can we get in there? 58 percent. Come up there and spy. Yeah, they've got high tier troops. What to do? Uh, should we send him? He still has that mission, right? It won't show up over there. Dear friends, what can we do for you today? Any map info? Only 145. Well, military access. This proposal is of little. Farewell then. Ooh, that's a. Legolas's dad, right? Thranduil. And there is Legolas. That's very rare. I've hardly ever seen that happen with the Wood Elves expanding like that. Right. Yes, sire. The journey is over, sire. Very odd indeed. Be of service? Of course, sire. Yes, sire. Off blocked. Let's give you two of those. We'll give you the best units we have. Five more. Right, we could try sending him on that mission to uh, Rivendell. Command me. We shall slaughter them, sire. They are doomed now, sire. Yeah, it was a shame, but we were kind of expecting it. Culture increase. We're already at ten percent. Hmm. No recruiting there or retraining. Hi, my king. 
will do them today, son. Right. Well, yep, money is building up. Uh, yeah, the High Elves did have that territory. Strange, because they must have gained all their territory over in the west, fighting against Angmar. But they didn't manage to take out the uh, Orcs of Moria, or the Goblins of Moria, I should say. I'm just wondering if that mission that he actually had to go to Rivendell is now null and void. No, oh, he didn't do so well that time. Oh, did uh, Gundabad get captured? Oh, well, except that. Yeah, our cousins have actually captured it. Just saw that. Look at that. Everyone's beating us. Um, Yeah, why don't you go and besiege them? Where you can actually assault them. Well, it looks like so Angmar's gone, uh, Dol Guldur is gone, the uh, Snow Orcs are going. I don't think Dunlun's done too much. I think. Isengard is also gone. It is good to see you, my friend. How can we help? No, we cannot agree. No, you'll give it at some point. Of course, sir. War. That's fine. Okay, he showed up over there. Let's get him to the front lines then. What do we need over here then? More culture or some military buildings? Because we've got enough culture now. Well, let's get those moving. What to do with this campaign? Right, well, we're going to have to decide. Hmm. Completed High Elves. Yeah, 252 turns remaining though. We lost... Seriously? I swear we lost a lot more battles than 25. Huh. Look at that, we won three times as many, and yet we lost the campaign. Well, there you go.